Dolly Parton, without question, is an illustrious country music icon, and she continues to transcend the boundaries of her musical prowess with her exceptional character and contributions to the world and her fans. And just prior to Christmas, Dolly Parton again made it abundantly clear that her fans mean the world to her. Just prior to Christmas, Dolly Parton jumped on the opportunity to make one of her biggest fans' dreams come true. After Dolly learned that one of her biggest fans, Utah resident LeGrand Gold, had been diagnosed with stage 4 colorectal cancer back in the year of 2021, and that one of his bucket list items included meeting her, she made it happen. Last Friday, on December 22nd, Dolly Parton surprised Gold with a phone call wishing him and his family a Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. And at the end of the call, Dolly even sang her hit song, I Will Always Love You, to Gold. Thanks to LeGrand Gold for sharing the beautiful and amazing experience onto his YouTube channel. We have the video for you right here. Making the day of so many people right now. Oh, well, I'm just happy to know I've got a fan that devoted and that I've had a chance to walk that journey all these years with. How did you pronounce his name? It's LeGrand. We, for short, you LeGrand? can just make it easy. It's LG. LG. That's good. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> I can remember that one. Yeah, it's a lot easier. A lot of people call him LG. Yeah. Okay. Well, it's LG. Uh, He's right here, and you should see the smile on his face. I Hey. <laughs> I cannot believe this. I'm doing pretty good right now, actually. <laughs> well, good. Well, I've heard you've been a fan of mine for many years, and I just wanted to thank you for that. Well, it's my honor, too. <laughs> well, I understand you're a lawyer. I should have had you on my team all these years. <laughs> You don't need any lawyers, Dolly. You do everything right. Well, I got good people. I'm surrounded with good people. I've had a few good lawyers in my life. I've had a couple of bad ones, but more good than bad, I think. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Well, LG, I really thank you for shooting out the word that you'd like to talk to me. I'm just happy that we got to kind of have our journey together in this lifetime. I always want to make people happy with my music and with the things I do and the things I say, and I'm just happy to know that I've touched your life in some way, so thank you for honoring me with that. Oh, that's awesome, yeah. You've been a huge help, especially these past two years. Um, well, good. But, um, well, we well, love you. Medication, sometimes that just kind of keeps you a little bit groggy. Yeah. Even throughout the day, don't it? Yeah, but... So it's, it's just early in the morning in Salt Lake. So I'm going to help him out, but we just want to tell you, we love your music. He's loved you his entire life. His family goes to Dollywood. Like, we've all been, like, season pass holders forever. And we love you the most. I mean, I don't know. The music probably has to be the top. But the person that you are is so inspiring. And number two, well, that's number three, is Imagination Library was all the difference for our kids when my husband, we had three kids when he started law school. Oh, yeah. Well, and yeah, those books were amazing. I'm really proud of. I'm glad your kids got to be part of that. Yeah. It's amazing. Good. Well, all right. Well, I hope all of you have a good holiday season. I guess if you ain't feeling too good, it won't be as good as it ought to be. But I just hope this lifts your spirits a little bit. And, uh, Thank you for letting me be your traveling companion, and I'll continue to travel on with you. How's that, LG? Oh, thank you, Dolly. Okay, well, you take care, and uh, just know that I will always love you. Aww. <laughs> okay, well, I, I should have sung that, shouldn't I? Yeah, will you, will you? I will always love you. Aww. I will love, always love you. Yeah. <laughs> okay, awesome. well, you take care. Thank All you, right. I will. Thanks, All Dolly. Right. <laughs> you are very welcome. Alice, you take care, and uh, I hope all of you have a, as good a Christmas as you can. We will. Thank you so uh, much. Well, you are very Best welcome. Best Christmas Bye. ever. Okay, thanks a lot. Uh -huh. Bye -bye. Wow.
Such a wonderful gesture there from Dolly and making that moment happen for Legrand and his family. The fan spoke to local news station KSL-TV out of Salt Lake City, Utah, following the phone call with Dolly where he shared that Parton calling him made him feel good and that he felt immortal now. KSL-TV also added that the fan had created a bucket list on a napkin with 10 wishes before he passed and the one that he thought would never happen, happened. That was number seven, meeting Dolly Parton. We are sending out all of our love and our prayers to Legrand and his family as he continues to fight his courageous fight. Be sure to do the same and show some love down below for Legrand and his family. As always, thank you all for tuning in here at CountryCast. That will be all for today's video.